Survey begins on the sidewalk at the Brockton Public Library. See some Latin, Latin Roman numerals, Latin script with the public spelled Vublik. This was built in 1912 and is a, a major institution in the, uh, in the city. This is the grand front entrance, which I think is pretty much not used anymore, partly because it would be very difficult to make it uh, accessible with all these stairs. And so there's a side entrance that's more the public entrance. But this is a, like any public library, especially a public library in a, in a city of some size, this is a place where people come from for all kinds of services. My wife, the uh, reference librarian at Bridgewater State, one of the reference librarians at Bridgewater State, worked in a public library in kind of a similar city in Texas that we lived in. And uh, all kinds of things like, um, literacy classes, uh, help with income tax forms, all kinds of things like that happen in public libraries. I'm gonna pause this and see about going inside. So this is the side entrance, the more modern entrance here. And of course, under COVID, they have signs announcing that they have reopened the library, but of course, with some restrictions about distance and masking. So the library entrance, uh, it, it looks like we either need to uh, make an appointment or something like that, and I did not, so um, not, uh, I'm being a little very COVID cautious myself anyway, so I'm not going to push that, but I am just going to take one last little clip here. I had not noticed this before in memory of Frederick J. Howe Jr., co-founder of the Brockton Library Foundation. If you see the need, take the lead. There's no date on this, but this is a pretty new bench, and it's acknowledging the importance of volunteerism in any any kind of community so they're often uh, always we find leaders who will do things um, to support local institutions so the library does rely on tax uh, taxes for most of its operating budget but there's always the need for something more and most libraries do have some sort of an association that does private fundraising uh, in addition to whatever public money is available for a library and so frederick howell was apparently one of the leaders in that sort of effort here in the city of Brockton. I've actually not encountered that name before.